Although candies are often linked with happiness and pleasure, certain treats have been prohibited due to their detrimental impact on health. Come along as we delve into the hazardous path of sweets, from dangerously elevated toxin levels to the risks of choking, potentially leading to serious health problems. Number 10. Lucas Mexican Candy Lucas Mexican Candy from South America gained worldwide demand but sparked controversy when the company targeted children. Sold in shaker containers, the powdered candy raised concerns due to its resemblance to drug use. Despite claims of being meant for fruit, tests revealed dangerously high levels of lead, leading to immediate regulatory bans. Haribo's sugar-free gummy bears faced a similar debacle in 2014. Replacing sugar with sorbitol, a sugar alcohol, caused severe gastrointestinal issues for some consumers. Reviews likened the experience to napalm, highlighting the unintended consequences of sugar substitutes. Number 9. Toxic Waste Candy Toxic Waste Candy gained fame for its extreme sourness, but the Toxic Waste Nuclear Sludge Chew Bar introduced in 2007 faced a different fate. Banned in 2011, concerns arose over its ingredients and production methods. The company's factory, located in Pakistan, came under scrutiny. Following tests, the FDA revealed significant levels of lead in the chew bars, posing potential harm to small children, infants, and pregnant women. Regulations mandate lead levels to be below 0.1 parts per million, yet the bars exceeded this limit by at least three times. The company behind Toxic Waste swiftly complied with the recall, discontinuing the chew bar instead of reformulating it. Before we move on, show us some love by liking, subscribing, and turning on notifications. Your support means the world to us. Number 8. The Lazy Larry Originally marketed as Lazy Cakes, the Lazy Larry is a brownie product specifically targeted towards children. While this might initially seem like an innocent indulgence, there's a catch. Its choice of ingredients raises eyebrows. Each Lazy Larry brownie contains a hefty 8 milligrams of melatonin, a supplement primarily used to aid adult sleep. However, its effects on children remain largely untested. The notion of using melatonin to pacify children might appeal to some, but the potential health ramifications of the Lazy Larry are shrouded in uncertainty. There's an urgent need for comprehensive research and isolation of its effects. Consequently, the FDA has openly flagged the Lazy Larry as a potential hazard, hinting at a possible ban in the future. While melatonin remains largely unregulated as a supplement, its integration into children's candy and desserts alters the equation significantly. The prospect of its availability on online platforms remains uncertain. Hence, it's worth pausing to reconsider before reaching for a pack of Lazy Larrys for your little ones. Number 7. White Rabbit Creamy Candy Candy companies constantly innovate, but sometimes they push the boundaries too far. Originating as a beloved treat in many Asian countries, White Rabbit Creamy Candy captured the hearts and palates of consumers with its delectable milky flavor and iconic rice paper wrapping. However, its journey from a cherished delicacy to a banned substance marked a dark chapter in the candy's history. In the early 2014, White Rabbit faced a crisis of confidence when melamine, a toxic chemical, was discovered in some batches of the candy. Melamine, commonly used in the manufacturing of plastics and resins, had been illegally added to food products to artificially inflate protein levels. Number 6. Candy Cigarettes these imitation cigarettes faced bans across numerous countries amid concerns that children might transition from the candy sticks to actual cigarettes. Candy cigarettes are prohibited in Brazil, Finland, Norway, Ireland, Saudi Arabia, and Turkey. In Canada, strict regulations mandate that candy cigarettes must not resemble real cigarette packaging, and they are entirely banned in the territory of Nunavut. Among the favored brands of these candy cigarettes was Popeye Tasty Candy Cigarettes. Although they are still available, they have undergone rebranding and are now marketed as candy sticks instead of candy cigarettes. Number 5. Giant Jawbreaker The Giant Jawbreaker, a candy novelty cherished by many, has been banned in several countries due to the potential choking hazard it presents. Its immense size, often exceeding that of a golf ball, makes it a tantalizing yet perilous confectionery. Despite its tempting layers of vibrant colors and promise of long-lasting sweetness, 
the sheer magnitude of the jawbreaker poses a significant risk. Encountering this behemoth of a candy can overwhelm even the most enthusiastic of candy connoisseurs, leading to instances of choking and subsequent bans in the interest of public safety. As such, the giant jawbreaker serves as a cautionary tale, reminding us that even the most seemingly harmless treats can harbor hidden dangers, urging us to exercise vigilance and moderation in our indulgences. Number 4. Blue Smarties Smarty Pants, also known internationally as Smarties or Rockets, have been a Halloween tradition since as far back as 1949. These colorful candies have been a source of joy for countless kids over the years. However, in recent times they've found themselves in a less savory light. Despite their innocent appearance, Smarties have unfortunately become associated with a troubling trend. Some individuals are using them as a substitute for drugs. Shockingly, these candies are being crushed and snorted, mimicking the dangerous behavior of drug use. This misuse not only poses serious health risks, but has also caught the attention of national authorities. It's crucial to understand that this issue isn't limited to Smarties alone. Similar trends have been observed with other beloved childhood candies, such as Fun Dip. Given Smarties' widespread popularity, there's a heightened risk of such misuse. Number 3. Free Candy While the idea of free candy sounds delightful, Madrid, Spain, took a different stance. The tradition of distributing sweets for free has been banned in the city. On January 5th each year, towns across Spain celebrate the Caligat de Deus Christmas Parade. During this event, three wise men greet children and distribute gifts. However, the tradition of throwing candy from the carriage into the crowds led to accidents. In 2013, tragedy struck when a six-year-old boy named Malago was fatally injured while trying to collect candy from the street. To prevent such heartbreaking incidents, strict rules have been enforced. Now, children in the region must resort to the age-old tactic of convincing their parents to indulge their sweet tooth. Number 2. Pez Candy Dispensers Pez candies have delighted generations with their colorful and flavorful offerings, but it's the iconic Pez dispensers that have drawn attention for potential hazards, especially vintage models. These older dispensers with small, detachable parts pose a choking risk, particularly to young children. Additionally, Pez candy contains red dye 3, a food additive set to be banned in California starting in 2027, highlighting ongoing scrutiny of food additives and safety measures. Number 1. Kinder Surprise Eggs Kinder Surprise Eggs, though not strictly a candy, have gained notoriety for blending the excitement of a toy with the deliciousness of chocolate. However, their allure conceals a potentially deadly threat, the small toy hidden within. Several countries, including the United States, have enacted bans on these eggs due to the grave choking hazard posed by the concealed trinket. Tragically, instances of ingesting the toy have resulted in fatal outcomes, compelling regulatory bodies to take swift action in prohibiting their sale and distribution. Thank you for tuning in to our Absolute Facts video. If you found it enjoyable, kindly like and share it with others who might also find it interesting. Your support truly means a lot to us. Stay tuned for our next captivating video. Until next time. Thank you.